Today we're seeing more hard stopping videos out of Beirut, including this wedding day horror as the blast goes off right in the middle of a ceremony. First, there was the bride of Beirut. Now there is another Beirut bride who will never forget her wedding day. It started as a day filled with joy. The parents of the bride to be walking down the aisle. Suddenly, a loud noise. Then, all hell breaks loose. Another camera captures a guest making the sign of the cross as she enters the church. Then comes the blast. There's the bride, her special day, scarred by the tragedy. Outside, there is total chaos. Then they see the pall of smoke in the distance. And look, debris covers the interior of the church where the bride and groom and their guests would have stood. Fury is growing over the fact that government officials knew that nearly 3,000 tons of ammonium nitrate had been stored at the port for six years and did nothing. I spoke to American survivor Rebecca Hovland. She's from Minnesota and told me how she narrowly escaped death. I luckily went in the middle of my apartment and didn't stay by a window because that's when the second explosion came. And that was the much bigger blast that just shattered all of my windows instantly. Um, and I mean, I, I was quite convinced I was gonna die at that moment. Hundreds of young volunteers have converged on the city to help with the cleanup.